The Spider Sis by Argen Barga. It was a beautiful spring datty in Equestrius when Twilight Sparkle was in her study where she lived. Spike, she said, come here, Spike, and Spike came over to her. What do you want, Twilight Spike said, and Twilight said, Spike, I need you to get me the book of magic, okay? Spike said, I will get it for you, and he went over to the bookshelf to get the book for Twilight Sparkle. It was a dusty book, and Spike almost sneezed, but he didn't. He gave the book to Twilight, and she said, Thank you, Spike, go away now. And Spike said, Okay, I will go away, and he slided away like a dragon. Twilight opened the book to chapter 5 and said, Okay, magic, please happen, and the magic began happening in her horn, and she did the spell. It was a magic spell, and she knew that it was magic, which is why she casted it, because her cutie mark is magic, because she is a unicorn. The spell made everything bigger and eight. Why is everything bigger and eight? Twilight said, Oh, it is because I'm a spider now. Sad face. Spider Twilight went up to the bookshelves to find a fix spell to fix the spell, but she couldn't open her books or even grab them because she was a spider and not a unicorn and her horn was gone and also she did not have a voice that could speak loud enough for Spike to hear her Adden go get the book for her Adden even if she did, she probably wouldn't want to because Spike would be see her as a spider and maybe get scared or angry and then stomp all over her which would make her dead spider twilight abd that is bad. And then she heard a voice, well not really a voice, but it sounded like another spider. She occult to understand the spider clicks and she knew that it was a spider and that she had to go and talk to this other spider because that is what spiders do, talk to other spiders. A red spider appeared and said, Hello Twilight, I am a Big Mac spider now? Why? And Twilight spider said, A uh, Big Mac spider, is it because I casted a spell that was sent wrong? And the big red Mac spider said, Okay, well maybe, but can you fix it? And Twilight said, Sad face. Oh, okay, said the red spider. Well, if we are going to be spiders forever, let's have spider sex. And Twilight spider said, Okay, well, but I don't want to know how to have spider sex. And big spider Mac Red said, It is probably easy, okay? Are you okay with this? I am asking permission to have spider sex with you. Twilight said, I don't know. Spiders are creepy and weird, sad face. And then Big Mac said, Twilight, we are spiders. And then Twilight said, you have a point, okay, I guess we have to make the most of it, right? And then Big Mac said that it is a spirit, yes, okay, spider sex. They started to have spider sex and it felt really weird for Twilight, but Twilight never even had normal regular pony sex, so spider sex was the weirdest, most strange thing ever. It was like a crunchy potato chip bag full of chips got thrown in. <laughs> It was like a crunchy potato chip bag full of chips got thrown into an chain link fence. <laughs> and I don't know where this metaphor go sing Emmy Nor. After the spider sex, Twilight felt funny on the inside, like something real, not normal. Big Mac, Big Mac Spider said, It's okay, Twilight Spider, if I live here with you so we can have more spider sex. And Twilight, he said, I don't know, I guess so, but I don't want to have spider sex for a while. That was weird, sad face. And Big Mac Spider Red said, This is okay, I will wait for you to be ready because I am a gentle spider. And Twilight said, Okay, I appreciate it. Well, that's chapter one. <laughs> Fucking brilliant. Well, <laughs> thank you for watching, I guess. This was the um, the best use of five minutes I've ever had, or four minutes, whatever. Um, yeah, if, if you enjoyed that, be sure to uh, like and subscribe, and don't forget to subscribe, I guess. <laughs> wow, um, thank you. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know what to do with my life anymore. Bye.